everybody. Welcome back to Cashing and Rain Checks. First, I want to apologize for not having any videos lately. Uh, fire season started early this year for me, so I headed out in March, and I've been out pretty much the entire summer fighting fire with the Chinook. So. chance to do any camping we haven't had a chance to do any videos so I'm finally home after a long 40-day tour I just did and four or five fires later um, I've decided to work on the generator you saw on our previous videos in quartzite where we were having generator problems well I have narrowed it down to what I think is the problem and that would be this right here that is the fuel pump I'll walk you through where it's at and how to change it. And uh, if you have any questions, you can leave them down there in the comments. So anyways, let's uh, get started on this, get this fixed and see if we can't get the generator working because we want to go camping uh, like next week. So if you have an Onan uh, 5500, the fuel pump is located, if you crawl underneath it, it is located right here. That is the fuel pump. That is the fuel filters. We're gonna pull this uh, fuel pump off, put the new one on, put a new filter on. We're probably gonna have to cut these connectors. I'm gonna go ahead and use some hose clamps on that. And then we'll see if uh, we can't get the generator to stay running. You can see it has another bolt on it and this is in the way but I have a special socket that might work in that <sighs> I'm going to go ahead and disconnect the electrical plugs and then uh, push them through. Um, <clears throat> the cool thing about this pump is the wiring for it has one female and one male spade connector. So the good thing about that is on the generator, you'll see we've got a female and a male. So they'll just plug right in there. So you can't get the wires wrong <clears throat> and get the wires backwards. So i got that disconnected. I'm going to feed this through so I can pull the pump down. And then I'm going to have to disconnect the uh, fuel line. So I've got some rubber gloves so I don't get gasoline all over myself. And uh, we'll get this thing installed. <music> red sealant that you put on there is good for gasoline and it says right here recommended for and it has gasoline <clears throat> if you use stuff that's just used for water it'll eat through it and you'll probably have a leak <laughs>
this uh, new hose clamp on there. Got the plugs plugged in underneath. We got the new pump. It's in, bolted in, and we're ready to start it and leak check it. Let's do that right now. I think sounds really good. Lines. Busy fire season. <laughs> All right, looks good. No leaks. All right, well, we got the fuel pump on. Generator is running. So Fingers crossed that it stays running. Before it would run, what, maybe 15 minutes? Yeah. Generator shut blah, 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 blah. off. So we're running just about 15 minutes now. It's still running. The pump sounded really good when we went to Prime compared to the stock one. The stock one just pretty much died. So I think we fixed it. We're going to see what happens here. I hope that helps you out if you uh, have generator problems. I forget the code that we were getting. I'll put it up here somewhere <laughs> i'll do it right now while i'm pointing to this that was the code that we got uh, for the generator that uh, said it was the fuel line uh, plugged or filter so i believed it was the pump and sure enough i mean it's running and has not quit so i think we fixed the problem if you do have that you can tackle that it's not real hard i want to thank you guys for watching Make sure you please share, like, subscribe. And ring the bell. That's right. Don't forget to ring that bell. And uh, hopefully we won't be as long on our next video as we were on this one. Fire season's over. I'm not uh, flying out there putting fires out. I'm actually home relaxing. And we're going to take the fifth wheel out on some cool adventures this winter. We're not going to tell you where we're going, but we'll have some pretty cool videos. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.